Welcome to another edition of Inside the Huddle. I am Matt Berry. He is Tashar Choice. We're in the Cambridge room here at the House of Blues in downtown Dallas. Tashar is back and bouncy as ever. Uh, how you doing, man? I haven't seen you in a couple weeks. Pretty good. About yourself. Where uh, you been? I've, well, the Texas Rangers are the baseball team in this town. Yeah. And I've been uh, doing some traveling with them. Oh, that's all they, good. No, no disrespect towards you or anything. <laughs> they just, they've kept me busy over the past couple of weeks. That's good. Now they're, they're back in the World Series. You know that, right? They're going to win it this year. You think so? I think so. Well, I don't want to put any pressure on you. But the Mavs won the title. I think the Rangers are going to win the World Series. And then there's that other team yeah. in town. That, yeah. That's you guys. Yeah, we got to play. We uh, had a tough game this last game. Uh, we got to be ready to roll, you know, get back on track here at home against the Rams. So we're looking forward to it. Now, you uh, you were saying during the bye week you got to go home for a little bit. Mm -hmm. You had a good time with that? I did. had a good time. Worked. You know, I didn't get a chance to hang out, really saw a couple of my family and friends, saw my little nephew, so I had to come back here, get ready to go, and, um, you know, that's all I did. Why don't you tell the beautiful people there behind us and in the camera who you brought on the show this week? Uh, today, I got my boy on, number 88, Dez Bryant, uh, real monster. It's going to be a great uh, football player, somebody who I got a lot of respect for, somebody who I mentor to make sure you stay cool. I like it when it get hot, though. Now, we're taping this show, so people aren't going to know this, but we'll just go ahead and throw Dez under the bus immediately. He's always late, like you said. Yeah, I mess with him. He better be on time today, though. And the other thing is, do you think he'll tell us during the taping of the show why his pants keep falling off during football games? Uh, yeah. I, I told him he got to quit doing that. So many people seeing him. Well, we'll get him a belt or something <laughs> while they're doing the show. To Shard and Matt, time now to go Inside the Huddle. Welcome to Inside the Huddle with Miles Austin and Tashard Choice. Inside the Huddle is shot live on location at the House of Blues every Monday night. It is another edition of Inside the Huddle here on FSN. I am Matt Berry. We are coming to you from the House of Blues in downtown Dallas. We have another fantastic show uh, for you planned. My co-host, as always, the one and only number 23, Tashard Choice, TC, making another appearance here on Inside the Huddle. Tashard, each and every week we are here, each and every week we like to talk about Cowboys football here on Inside the Huddle, brought to you by Westway Ford. We're coming off a loss this week, 20-16 to 16 to the New England Patriots. You guys go into a hostile environment, and for a while, I'd call it three and three-quarters quarters. It looked like you guys were going to pull that thing away. But there's no shame in a guy like Tom Brady coming down to the end and making that big pass. Just talk about the game on Sunday and just going forward. Um, first, it was tough. It's tough to swallow, you know, swallow – Losing games like that, you know, especially after we played well, you know, the first three quarters and to lose the game in the last, you know, two minutes and that last drive. It's a lot of different things that we could have put ourselves in different situations not to be in that, you know, be in that, be in that moment. So we got to do better. You know, me personally, as a team, you know, everybody, you know, takes that to heart. And we have a really good football team, but we got to do something to get over the edge and not make games close and to close people out. What are the Patriots fans like in Boston? Are they just a different breed of people? Funny. Really? Yeah, they, you know, how they talk, their language is a little different. How do they talk, by the way? Just give I us a little, why don't you give us a little bar of how the, the, I can't the New it. England I'm, people talk? I'm country myself, so, you know, I can't, <laughs> I can't even do it. But, you know, it's funny because you hear them say all type of things. Uh, it's crazy. But it's crazy how fans know everything about you from, College, you know, all the way to the pros, every game, they talk about you. So it's really cool. All it does is really motivate you. Uh, each and every week, Deshard, my co-host, we bring on a guest every week. We're excited about this week's guest. Deshard, why don't you uh, tell the audience at home and, and in attendance tonight here at the House of Blues who we are bringing on inside the huddle tonight. Uh, bringing on my guy, man. Uh, we're going to Dez Bryant, uh, somebody who's really talented, a, a young monster. That's what I call him. Somebody who I, lo I love his fire, his emotion. As you probably saw in the football game, somebody who really cares about, you know, wins and losses and his teammates. So one of the young guys on the team, somebody who's going to do really well for the football team. So I got to bring him on. We are looking forward to visiting with Des Bryant. This is Inside the Huddle, brought to you by Westway Ford. This segment brought to you by CC Carpet, Alberts, and Under Armour, IPMS, and Social Meds. We are back at the House of Blues after the break. This is Inside the Huddle on FSA. This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by... Westway Ford, CC Carpet, 
and Albertsons. It means a great deal. And we have a big sale. Check this out. You're going to be excited. Wait. Oh. On everything, everything zero percent. No, Jack. No. Zero percent on select models. There you go. Wait. Get zero percent on every pre-owned and zero percent on select new Fords at WestwayFord.com. Just two minutes east of George Bush on 183 at Irving, Las Colinas. Here's the game plan. Save a little cash and show your cowboy spirit. Save 10 percent on groceries at Albertsons every Cowboys game day when you wear your favorite jersey. Hey. 10% off all your game day favorites. And I know just the jersey to wear. Well, that's a great one. Dad, get out your pink shirt. It's time to decorate for the cure. Well, Morgan, I'm not only getting out my pink shirt, I'm getting my pink smart cushion. So every time you see pink carpet pad, you know there goes another donation for Susan G. Komen for the cure. And right now with your purchase and installation of Staymaster Ultra Live carpet, you get free pink smart cushion. Or you can purchase with any other carpet style. Foot and heel pain can be debilitating. From the moment you wake up, it can feel like you're walking on a bed of nails. If you've experienced burning, numbness, or tingling in your foot, it could be an entrapped nerve. At the Microsurgery Institute of Dallas, we specialize in one of the most advanced nerve decompression procedures available. So you can do the things you like to do and start to walk away from foot pain for good. Call or log on to Microsurgery Institute of Dallas and start to walk away from foot pain today. Get it louder. Coming closer. Footsteps don't lie. So the question is, do you hear footsteps? Or are they hearing yours? This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Under Armour. Protect this house with Under Armour. Innovative plumbing mechanical services. And social meds. Welcome back to Inside the Huddle on Fox Sports Net. We are at the House of Blues in downtown Dallas. It's presented by Westway Ford. This segment brought to you by Microsurgery Institute, HMS, IHOP, and Papa John's. Be sure to check us out, CowboysLive.com. Follow us on Twitter, CowboysLive2011. Our first guest, without question, is one of the most electric wide receivers in the league. He's a second-year guy out of Oklahoma State. Anytime he touches the ball, he could score a touchdown. We're just working on him keeping his pants on during the game. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Our first guest, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the one and only number 88, Dez Bryant. Yeah. yeah. Hello, Dez. What's up, hey, how y'all doing? <laughs> how are you doing? Oh, I'm doing good, and you? I'm doing all right on a Probably. Monday night. I appreciate you coming on with Deshard. He's, uh, he's yeah, a big fan you. of yours. Thank you, uh, bro. I'm a big fan of his, and I don't mind at all being on the show. Well, yeah, we appreciate fun. having you. Uh, first and foremost, out of the gate, Des, I've had three people come up to me and ask me already. Uh, people ask me all this, ask me this all the time at work. Why do your pants keep falling off? Tashar says he talks to you about it. Why do it's your funny. pants keep falling off during the game? <laughs> well, I like to I, I like to feel loose. You know, um, I don't like wearing a, a lot of pads. You know, and me, I feel like it's gonna slow me down. So I just put a jock strap in my pants. Got my butt showing, like, it's fine. I just got to feel loose. <laughs> Tashard was talking about earlier on the sh before the show now how the, one of his biggest things that he likes about you is that you just get fired up. Yeah. And you just, you just love playing football. When we see you on the sidelines yelling and hooting and hollering, what exactly are you saying? And what are you during the game? Like, you know, um, in a New England game, you know, I just felt like we was in one of those situations that we needed to be real fired up. Because it was our moment, you know, to, to do something a lot of teams haven't done. Right. You know, I think, if I'm not mistaken, the Patriots, like, 18, 19 at 19 home, are they under, yeah. Yeah, they're undefeated. And I feel like we had the perfect opportunity to do that. And I just wanted to get our guys fired up. And I felt like it was the right time, the right moment, you know, and it just in me. You know, I just, I just have a passion for this game, and I don't think it'll ever change. So you guys will come in the huddle before play, and if he's, if he's bouncing back and forth, you know something good's about to happen. Absolutely. It's right. just, it's, if he does something well, 
it draw the whole team. Like he made a play the other day where he made that dude fall on, fall on his butt. You saw that? Oh, I saw it. Yeah, good move, boy. <laughs> so what did you do when that happened? Oh, you fired up. Because it's your turn. You want to get the ball, you want to do something right. to get him fired up. Right. It's just vice So you guys play off each other in the right. yeah. yeah. That's how it's supposed to be. Yeah. You know, um, I would never mouse make a play. It made me want to make a play. Whenever yeah. I make a play, it make TC want to make a play. Yeah. Or, you know, whoever on the team. It's just, you know, we all got to feed off of one another. We just, you know, we, I, I feel like we got the team to do it. And, you know, um, we're just going to continue to keep getting better each and every day in practice. And hopefully it's going to come along. And I really feel like it's going to happen. It is my favorite segment of the show. It's when Tashar Choice takes over and interviews his teammate. We'll have that much, much more coming up next on Inside the Huddle on FSM, presented by Westway Ford from the House of Blues in downtown Dallas. This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Westway Ford Home Marketing Services. HMS is your one-stop shop for all your real estate and mortgage needs. And IHOP. For Dallas Cowboys cornerback Allen Ball, running back to shard choice, and cornerback Orlando Skandrick requires strength, preparation, vision, and focus. But it no longer requires contact lenses. At least not anymore. Thanks to eye LASIK by Dr. Harvey Carter, official eye surgeon of your Dallas Cowboys. Call to be a part of the Carter Cowboys LASIK celebration. Thank you, Dr. Carter. Dad, get out your pink shirt. It's time to decorate for the cure. Well, Morgan, I'm not only getting out my pink shirt, I'm getting my pink smart cushion. So every time you see pink carpet pad, you know there goes another donation for Susan G. Coleman for the cure. And right now with your purchase and installation of Staymaster Ultra Live Carpet, you get free pink smart cushion. Or you can purchase with any other carpet style. Book your perfect getaway now. All I know, I know, I know it's better when you're here. Why wait until the last minute to save? Lock in the best pricing right now for the vacation of your choice with Apple Vacations. Turn fantasies into realities in Mexico, including air, hotel, all meals and drinks. For the right advice and best price, ask an agent. Hurry, best dates and hotels are going fast. Touchdown, Cowboys! Yeah. We'll be right back. This season, the Papa John's Cowboys Unlimited Combo is back. And at $10.99 for a large Papa John's pizza with unlimited toppings and a Pepsi 2-liter, it's a dream. With the Cowboys Unlimited Combo, you can get your Papa John's pizza however you want it. It's the perfect combination of hot, fresh Papa John's pizza, ice-cold Pepsi, and Dallas Cowboys football. Order yours online for just $10.99. Better ingredients, better pizza. Papa John's. This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Papa John's. Better ingredients, better pizza. Heradura Tequila. And Lifestyle Technologies, your solution for integrated electronics in the home and office. Welcome back to Inside the Huddle, presented by Westway Ford here on FSN. We are at the House of Blues in downtown Dallas. This segment brought to you by Lifestyles Technology, Heradura Tequila, 7-Eleven, and Apple Vacations. Uh, the injury report brought to you by Microsurgery Institute. You got to play football. There's going to be injuries. Bill Nagy, broken leg, and Felix Jones, a high ankle sprain. We'll continue to see how Felix improves throughout the week. Bill Nagy likely uh, not to come back for the season. Tashard Choice, our special guest, Des Bryant, joining us this week. I have incited a riot during the commercial break. Tashard went to OU slash Georgia Tech. Des Bryant, we all know, went to Oklahoma State. Uh, Georgia Tech lost to a bad Virginia team this weekend. Sorry, uh, they did. Tough. And uh, Oklahoma State got a win. And now Boy, the argument road. over the BCS was whether Oklahoma State was third or fourth. Tashard went to OU. OU was third. Oklahoma State was fourth. And now you guys have a bet going into Bedlam, which is at the end of the season when Oklahoma and Oklahoma Ooh. State play each other. Well, we talk a lot of trash. You should see us. We <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because we be in the weight room talking trash about receivers, the teams, all the time. So we got a little bit. Now every uh, every week on the show we turn it over to Tashard because he is one of the co-hosts 
Uh, this is the best part of the program here on Fox Sports Net. Tashard, this is your interview segment now. This you want to give me a job, still? <laughs> yeah, I'll get you a job. All right, so I may ahead. need one. So go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, brother? Not much, What's man. up, my boy? What's up? How you doing? Good. What's your favorite color, man? Favorite color, black. Black. Oh, yeah. See? See how we the same? Everyone's been blue so far. For real? Don't interrupt mm, me no, drinking, no, no, by no, the way. I'm black. That's all good. So talk to me. So how you, how you feel about, what's, what's, what's the main thing you know the difference between the pros and college? Um, you want my honest yeah. answer? All right, my honest answer is really, I really think the pros is much easier. The only reason why I say that because of, in college, I ain't see too much man, too much one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah. I always got double team and, right. you know, a lot of zone coverages. Yeah. I, well, when I see that one-on-one -on -one in the league, my eyes get big. You know, I start visualizing, you yeah. know, what I'm going to do after the play. You know, that's just the truth. I love it. Oh, man, I love that. <laughs> so tell me, so... How you feel about the rest of the year? How you feel about what you want to do this season, your personal goals and, you know, the team goals? Well, you know, um, I like to keep my personal goals to myself. But, you know, far as, you know, like um, you know, far as the team, yeah. uh, you know, I like our chances. Yeah. You know, I feel like, you know, we are, it might sound crazy, I think we, I think we are unbeatable. You know, I think the losses, we lost those games ourselves. Yeah. And I feel like, you know, once, you know, we get back in that meeting room and we regroup, and, you know, we, we learn from our mistakes. You know, the sky's the limit for us. Looking back to both of your rookie years, because everyone makes mistakes in their rookie years. Right. It's just, it's natural. What's the most embarrassing thing <laughs> that happened to you during either of your rookie years? Anything. I was late one day. I was late to a meeting. I thought it was the lunch in. Mm -hmm. So I was waiting for the lunch in, but mm -hmm. I forgot we had special teams and teams meet before the lunch in. So I showed up. To the mean late, I had on a wife beater with some dress pants <laughs> and some tennis shoes. So when I walked in the door late, everybody looked at me like, oh, man, choice. So it was funny because everybody tried to talk to me. I wouldn't say nothing to nobody because I was so upset at myself. <laughs> we'll get Dez's most embarrassing moment uh, in his rookie year after the break. This is Inside the Huddle presented by Westway Ford. We are at the House of Blues here in downtown Dallas on FSN. We'll wrap up the show. Coming up after the break. This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Westway Ford, Apple Vacations, Dymaco, and Pepsi Max, the official soft drink of the Dallas Cowboys. Keith, you know when you've made it? No. You've made it. Once you get your own action figure, check this out. What do you think? Impressive? Where's your action figure? That's not an action figure. Sure it is. No, that's a bobblehead. And anyone can have a bobblehead. Anyone doesn't have one now. Drive up to 790 miles on a single tank and get 7,000 in rebates on any F-Series truck at westwayford.com. Two minutes east of George Bush on 183 at Irving, Las Colinas. You know my Jason, when he really wants something bad enough, there's no point in trying to stop him. So when he wants a great steak, I go straight to Albertsons because I know that they only sell the best USDA choice beef. Always tender, always full of flavor. That's what Jason wants every time. And believe me, you wouldn't want to get in his way. Now that's choice. And it's only choice beef at Albertsons. Albertsons, it means a great deal. People talk about how hard it is to get a house and all the trouble you have to go through. You don't have to go through all that trouble if you're talking with the right people. People always say it's who you know. Well, HMS is the people you need to talk to, and that's who you need to know because they've taken care of us. We called, we came in for the evaluation the same day. They were like, you qualify for this much, you can get a house. And we were calling everybody. We knew at that point, like, we're going to get a house. Get out of the rent race, call HMS. Book your perfect getaway now. All I know, I know, I know it's better when you're here. Why wait until the last minute to save? Lock in the best pricing right now for the vacation of your choice with Apple Vacations. Turn fantasies into realities in Mexico, including air, hotel, all meals and drinks. For the right advice and best price, ask an agent. Hurry, best dates and hotels are going fast. 
Foot and heel pain can be debilitating. From the moment you wake up, it can feel like you're walking on a bed of nails. If you've experienced burning, numbness, or tingling in your foot, it could be an entrapped nerve. At the Microsurgery Institute of Dallas, we specialize in one of the most advanced nerve decompression procedures available. So you can do the things you like to do and start to walk away from foot pain for good. Call or log on to Microsurgery Institute of Dallas and start to walk away from foot pain today. Do you hear that? Footsteps. 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 They're moving faster. Get it loud. Come in close. Footsteps don't lie. So the question is, do you hear footsteps? Or are they hearing yours? This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Gillespie Jewelers, Champion Limousines, Replicopy, and your local 7-Eleven store. Welcome back to Inside the Huddle, presented by Westway Ford here on FSN. We are at the House of Blues in downtown Dallas. This segment brought to you by Diamond Co., Gillespie Jewelers, Champion Limousines, and Barcelo Hotel and Resorts. I am joined by my co-host, Tashar Choice, as always, our special guest this week. Number 88, Des Bryant. Both of them having a good time. Uh, we said before the break that we were going to talk to Des about the most embarrassing moment his rookie year. Tashar told us it was when he showed up to a meeting late. Uh, Dez had the infamous <laughs> shoulder pad incident. Uh, not sure that was the most embarrassing. It was the most talked about. We know that. But what was your most embarrassing moment, Dez? You know, to tell the truth, that was, you know, probably my most embarrassing, my most embarrassment moment. Because, um, <laughs> you know, we in a stretch line. And, um, you know, Roy said some things to me. I won't repeat his words. Um, <laughs> you know, and I got mad. You know, I ain't like what he said. And <laughs> I just got angry at Roy and said some words that y'all really don't even want to hear. And, uh, you know, Coach broke us apart. And, you know, I went on about my business. He went on about his business. Then he said something else. Then I said something else. Then we just going back and forth, going back and forth. And then when I got to thinking about it, I was like, man. I know from an outside person looking in, I, I probably look kind of stupid, you know, the way I reacted, but I, I thought that was my most bad moment. <laughs> the media got hold of that, didn't oh, yeah. This is dinner. Oh, yeah, blame it on us. This, uh, this, yeah. <laughs> I want it's, always our, it's always our fault. I wanted them to course. fight. I would have been laughing. What would you, you would have laughed? That they got to fight. <laughs> Absolutely. Who would have won? Uh, I don't know, man. <laughs> I would have been laughing. <laughs> But we fight though. We fight a lot though. Really? Yeah. It's just part of it though. Yeah, it, it, like it your is. brother. Yeah. So you guys will fight inside the Valley Ranch. It won't be no physical fight. It won't fight. be no physical fight. You know, it, but you know, be some, some, some words exchanging. But then at the end of the day, we all come together. We shake each other's hand. We both understand the situation, and then after that, it's really it's nothing. You know, at some point this season, we're gonna get you to do your Forrest Gump impression. Hold on. You haven't told him about the dance. Oh, there's the dance, dance you do. Oh, Which wow. One? I'm talking about the show. The... Oh, yeah. See, I got all type of dances I make up. Oh, do you? New slang words. <laughs> Give us a uh, slang word that's clean for TV. Oh. <laughs> Drop it low. <laughs> when the, the definition, sir. <laughs> I can't tell you. <laughs> it's not clean for TV, <laughs> is it? <laughs> uh, look, I can't tell you. I got a lot of them. I got a lot of them. Give me one of the dances. Oh, my man. Dance. Hey, yeah. hey, hey, can he, hey, can he get a beat or something? I can't do it over yeah, here. You guys want to give him a clap something? or a beat? Give him a clap. You Next time I score, I'm going to do it. You can't stand up because you're I wired. Know. But give me, give me a sit-down sit sit down. A sit down <laughs> version of the dance. If I can, if I can look, get a, they're giving you the beat. You have to do it now. They're giving you the beat. They're giving you the applause. If, if I can stand up, I'll do it. i do it after the show. He'll do it after the I show. He can't all stand up after the wire, but we'll get, it, we'll get uh, an extra version. For all you. Now, <laughs> Dez, when, when you both score next week, let's, let's have Dez promise the people here at House of Blues uh, who came to see the show, when you score a touchdown this week, Give us a little something that you're going to do when you score to let them know that was your thank you for coming to the program. Um, usually, I hold up the, usually I hold up the X, but um, 
Why don't you do a chicken dance or something? Why don't you do something? Y'all like that? Yeah. A chicken dance? All right, so Des Bryant's going to do a chicken dance when he scores a touchdown yeah. next week. Tashard, when you score, what are you going to do? I got a little funky dance. I'm going to stank your leg it all the way. <laughs> And not only, and not only that, that thing not, only, up. not only that, I want to come back, and I hope and I hope all y'all can make it back. Um, I want y'all to tell me what y'all thought about it. I'm My gonna wind that thing up all the way to the ground. <laughs> all right, I'm trying to get on top ten sports. So. You know, you seem to me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm you, telling y'all, you seem to me the kind of guy that would do the Carlton real good. Yep. Uh, yep. <laughs> he can know. do the Carlton, can Yep. I can do really any dance. I should have been on Next Best Dance Group. Uh, the what? MTV. <laughs> you ever seen it? No. Oh, they changed it to X Factor now. X Factor. Oh. You could have been on X Factor. Yeah. Yeah. And do, yeah, and then I hear you're a good comedian. You want to end the show? We've got a minute left in the show here. Would you like to uh, leave us with a joke for the beautiful, a clean one? Hey, Dan, oh. I got a question for you. <laughs> you on the first date with your girlfriend? She comes to your house and she has to use the bathroom number two. Do she get a another date? Hell no. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> question. Next question. We got time? Oh, we got as much time as you want. I got another question for you. Would you take a girl who has bad breath or messed up teeth? Man, what kind of question are you asking me? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Man, um, well, one? now you have to answer. Pick one. <laughs> nah. Well, we, can, we can work on the breath. <laughs> I love it. We can I work love on the breath. It. Can, I don't you, know about the teeth. You can I throw a few it. Altoids in Too much I money. It. I love it. Ladies and gentlemen, round of applause for Des Bryant and Tashard Choice. This has been Inside the Huddle presented by Westway Ford. Our thanks to Ray Salinas, Robin McDaniel, SMI, Gridiron, and Ted Nichols Payne, he's the my, uh, man behind the sound. CowboysLive.com is the website. The Twitter is CowboysLive2011. We'll be here next Monday at the House of Blues. This is another edition of Inside the Huddle, presented by Westway Ford on FSN. We'll see you guys next week. Inside the Huddle is sponsored by Carter Eye Center, HMS, Papa John's, Westway Ford, Albertsons, Lifestyle Technologies, the Microsurgery Institute, Under Armour, Pepsi Max, and your local 7-Eleven store. Inside the Huddle is a production of Sports Media. Video production by Gridiron Films.